Just over a year after being established, an alarming data has been recorded by the Free Call Center. In its first year of operation, over 2,576 calls have been reported with high concerns of family and sexual violence abuse, with nearly three quarters of those calls resulting in counseling sessions and referrals. One of the functions of, of the counseling center was to provide information to people who call in to seek information. And secondly, uh, when a survivor calls into the counseling center, they provide safety planning. And thirdly, they, they provide cri crisis counseling. They provide crisis counseling to survivors and also they provide uh, suicide intervention to callers who call into the counseling center. The One Talk Counseling Help Him line has been helpful with confidential counseling and referrals of people seeking help. However, the center is also conscious of the shocking increase in emotional abuse, physical violence and threats to harm reported by callers. Interestingly, the data recorded shows that both survivors of abuse and perpetrators of violence are using the hotline service for help. We have here the trained counselors and experienced counselors who are who are many in our counseling center. So when this when they receive these calls, they were in a position to respond to their calls and help uh, assist the, the survivors. Project officer Wes Siku says calls have come all over the 22 provinces of the country, with highest number of calls from Central, Southern Highlands, Chimbu, East Sipik, and Morobe province. The hotline service is in its infant stages, however, is critical in minimizing and addressing the extreme rates of violence that exist in communities around PNG. If it means to, to reduce the number of incidents that is happening within the country, we have to do a lot of advocacy, do a lot of awareness to bring down the rate of domestic violence or gender-based violence which is happening throughout the country. The project is a partnership between Child Fund PNG, CIMC, FH360 New Zealand Aid, USAID, Child Fund New Zealand and Child Fund Australia. Jack Lopave, Jr. National, MTV News.